Hi, this video is on how to back up your smart notebook content. Uh, and by that, I do not mean uh, smart notebook files. If you've saved lots of files and lesson plans you've done, uh, those are just saved wherever you put them in my documents and they need to be backed up to your T drive. I'm talking about smart content. And what that is, is if you've gone and make made content folders that you use over and over again in your class, those have to be backed up separately. So what does that mean? I'm on my smart notebook and if I go here to the little picture on the side, I see my content up here, which is where we find all the lesson content if we were going to use any of these pictures and things that are in there. But you can design your own content. So you can see in here I've got content for chapter one that has some pictures that I use to explain what different things are on a computer. Um, I I've got chapter three, chapter four, you can see all those things and they're pictures that I've collected over time so that I don't have to go and look and find them. I can just go, oh, there it is and pull out a, pic a picture of SD RAM uh, when I'm talking about it to my students. So this is only if you have that kind of content built in your smart notebook so that you can pull it out. It's kind of like a bunch of clip art that you've designed yourself to teach smart lessons with. If you have, you need to back that up. So I right click on my content and say export as a collection file. And then I'm going to navigate to my T drive and I'm going to call it Smart Content 2019 and hit save and exports that then easily for you into a file that then afterwards you can import again to get it back into your smart notebook. That's all there is to it if you've got smart content.